All right, guys. Today I got a very, very cool card trick to show you. Um, basically, all you need is a deck of cards, and you'll be ready to go. So you can go ahead and you can start shuffling up the deck a little bit like this. And um, basically, what you're gonna do is the pattern can change. You can pretty much say whatever you want. Um, but essentially, what you're gonna try and do is tell your spectators that whether or not they believe you, they kind of have this subconscious ability um, to know. The position of any card in the deck. So in this case, let's say for example, like the Eight of Spades, all right, a super random card. You tell your spectator, you know, you could pick a number one through fifty-two, and we can go through and probably find your card. But to make this a little bit easier, we'll do ten through twenty. Okay, so just pick a number ten through twenty, and then we'll see um, if you can locate the uh, the Eight of Spades. So all your spectator says, let's say a number like, let's say like eighteen, right? So you deal down one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. All right, so out of 10 and 20, your spectator happened to pick 18. And to, let's say, let's you know mix up a little bit more, we can go ahead and add the digits of 18. So 1 and 8, and we'll get 9. So we do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then this position should be the 8 of spades. And this is a trick, guys. It'll work every single time. And uh, don't forget to stick around for the tutorial. All right, guys, so here's how you're going to be able to do the trick. So um, the setup is super, super simple. You can do this. Um, like I said, you know, you can grab any deck of cards. And, you know, as you're just casually talking to your spectators or even before you go up to see them before the trick, you just count out 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 cards. So basically you need a 10-card packet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And as you do that, you flip it over and you take a look at it. Okay, so in this case, we have the six of clubs. So you remember that card, all right? And if you're looking at it, one, two, three, ten cards down from the top, you're going to have the, you know, whatever card in this case, like I said, the six of clubs. And with this being in the tenth position, um, you're pretty much ready to go and the trick is set up. So at this point, all you're going to have to do is, you know, kind of nonchalantly just kind of, you know, shuffle the deck. And all you're doing is making sure that you're leaving that six on top of the deck. So whatever your setup is, just make sure you leave it 10th um, tenth, tenth down from the top. And then at this point, like I said, you, you remember the card. You tell your spectator, you can bring up to them that they can pick a number one through 52, but you know, so it doesn't take all day. Let's just do, you know, 10 through 20. And um, at this point, your spectator picks whatever they want. Um, and now if they do pick a 20, um, it is not gonna work. Um, Cause basically what you need them to do is if they do pick 20, you kind of, you can bring up a little bit of like a, you can get specific about the word choice and just say, well, we'll just pick one. It's, it's between 10 and 20. So like, you know, between 10, and 20, not including those numbers. So that's what happens if they say that. Cause you don't really want to tell them to pick between 10 and 19. Cause it'll sound a little bit fishy, but so let's say they pick a number like 15, for example, all you do is you deal down one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. All right, so we got 15 cards dealt down from the top, right? But obviously, the spectator's card is not 15 cards down. It's only 10. So from here, what you do is you'd say, okay, we're going to mix up the selection even a little bit more. Um, we're going to go and add the digits of 15, in this case, 1 and 5, and we'll get 6. So then from this packet, you deal 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and the sixth card exactly is going to be their card, and I believe it was the six of clubs. So this is the trick, guys. It'll work anytime. All you have to do is just know which card is ten cards down from the top of the deck. And that's about it. It's super simple. And um, I hope you guys like it. And as always, thanks for watching.